Google sends out press invitations for its 2015 Google I.O. event. We hear more details on when other flagship smartphones are getting lollipop. And that mystery Apple van seems to include Tesla engineers and even Scooby-Doo. I'm Jaime Rivera and uh, celebrate with me, we are three days away from Friday. This is Pocket Out Daily brought to you by Lynda.com. The official news today have to do mainly with Google, starting with Google I.O. The company has already sent out press invitations and we know that it will happen on May 28th and 29th, which is just a couple of days away from WWDC. Now we know that this is uh, the company's developer conference as well. We expect to see the latest and greatest version of Android here, or at least a major upgrade and, you know, also in conjunction with other projects like hopefully the future of Google Glass. Stay tuned for that. And speaking of Google, the company really wants to double down on its security up to the point where it's willing to give you away something, not monetarily, but uh, the company is apparently going to give you two gigabytes of free Google Drive storage if you just go in and update your security settings. That's all you have to do. Uh, the promotion and the, all the details are in the links in the description. Just follow them and hey, two gigabytes, why not? And raise your hands, how many of you are enjoying Android 5.0 Lollipop on an AT&T modded device? because I just uh, tweeted yesterday how much I was enjoying it on my 1M8 from T-Mobile because my AT&T unit hasn't gotten it yet, nor my Moto X. But uh, the company is apparently going to do something different with the LG G3. Uh, users are already confirming that they are receiving the firmware upgrade to Lollipop, but uh, beware, apparently those that have are having issues with uh, Google services, apparently they're not working. Uh, stay tuned for that, we'll keep you posted, but yeah, I'll go downstairs and get my G3 and hopefully get the update. And speaking of interesting upgrades, uh, we have more details on the HTC One M9. We still don't know if we're dealing with decoys here, but apparently the company is investing in two different things that are going to be important for this phone. First of all, the wireless chipset on this phone will apparently bring you better wireless intensity, which is uh, really good considering the fact that the One M8 wasn't really bad, but I do personally notice that it has uh, far less reception than other smartphones that are made of aluminum. And in addition to that, apparently, uh, the camera at the back, aside from being a larger 20 megapixel sensor, according to some rumors, will apparently be built by Toshiba and will give us better image quality, which is interesting since uh, Sony BSI sensors have ruled the world here. Uh, we don't know why we're getting a change, but stay tuned. Why not? Let's see what Toshiba's got to offer. And finally, for the very interesting rumors of the day, last week we reported that uh, there was this interesting Apple van. It was an Apple leased van with a lot of cameras at the top, and uh, we thought it was that Apple wanted to get its own street view. But uh, reports claim that Apple has been able to interest as many as 50 former Tesla engineers to come work at Apple. And when you get people from Tesla, we're talking about building a vehicle here. Apparently these uh, were focused on mechanics and robotics, so. I don't think it has to do anything with software. Could it be that Apple is working on its own smart car? Uh, whatever it wants to call it, the iCar or whatever, because hey, Google is working on its own self-driving car as well. Or it could just be that because CarPlay has not really taken off, it could also be that uh, Apple also wants to get some, you know, high-end folks to work on that part as well because Tesla had a really good one. But it leads me to the question of the day. What would you prefer, an iCar or better CarPlay? Uh, because in my case, uh, I don't know, I would prefer both. Uh, CarPlay on a replaceable, you know, car dashboard, uh, you know, car stereo, or a car, why not? But leave us a comment down below, what's your case? And folks, if you've ever wanted to learn how to build your own application, become a pro photographer, or hey, even build a cool video like this one, there are thousands of awesome courses at our sponsor, lynda.com slash pocket now. That's l-y-n-d-a dot com slash pocket now for a free 10-day trial. You also know the drill if you want to get the news earlier before this video was filmed. Make sure you follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.